Hello and welcome back to Provis Gaming and more Civilization V Community Balance playing as Byzantium. Alright, we've stabilized ourselves from our happiness perspective, which is really good because now we're actually making a good amount of money, culture, and science. So hopefully we can start catching up fairly soon. We're also about to have the World Congress, which I did promise I was going to talk a little bit about in this video because I have an idea for something we might be able to do. Uh, we'll see if it works or not, but... Alright, Vatican City is still currently ours. Uh, Cahokia, we're in pretty good shape, and our colonist is ready to go as soon as Cardiff burns to the ground. Nice, let's move on and see what happens. <clears throat> so, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Crap, they did exactly what I was afraid they were going to do. Okay, Brazil just took Vatican City. That's really bad. I, I, I need to get a, another diplomat. I need to purchase one. I can't wait. It'll take too long to build one. So, what the heck? Yeah, we, we have no choice. We have to get a diplomat. I need the Vatican. I cannot afford to fight the Vatican City right now while my army is on this continent. Okay. So why don't you go over here? Why don't you go here and heal? You go to sleep. You go to sleep. You set up and heal. You go on alert. And this colonist is ready to go. Let's land right here. Okay. Okay, we're about to get our connection up to Nantes and everywhere else as soon as this guy is done, which should be pretty much now, I think. And that will make a huge difference for our happiness. If we can just get the diplomat up here in time to the Vatican City, we'll see how well that works out. Okay, assigned delegates. So, we have the World Religion Eastern Orthodoxy, and that's really important for us, obviously. The uh, founder of the city gets an extra vote uh, in the, in the uh, World Congress, which is going to be very useful. And we also get 50% tourism in the Holy City, which is our capital, which has a ton of tourism already. So that's huge. Uh, currently, 11 delegates saying no? Huh. Is that, is that true? Somebody really doesn't want me to get it, but okay. I'm going to put like seven votes here, and we'll see if it goes. The other thing... Well, see, it says yay 11... Okay, no, no, no. This lies, and I've always been confused about this. So it says, our count for the proposal stands at yay 11 delegates. No, it knows that America wants it. So it says 11 delegates potentially could apply toward decolonization of Brazil. This also says that we know America does not want this. So potentially up to 11 delegates from America voting no on this. Yeah, I don't, I don't think they're going to delegate that much toward it because they really want this decolonization. So what this is going to do, if successful... The player's influence, in this case Brazil, lowers their, uh, their uh, influence over city-states to 50, which means that instantly Brazil would lose their, um, uh, their control over Vatican and the two city-states down here. I think it was Kaisel and Monaco, which is really good, especially right before a war, because I think we're about two or three turns out. So I'm going to commit the delegates. We're going to try to get the Eastern Orthodoxy. We're going to try to get decolonization of Brazil. If I can get both, so much the better, but we'll see. Okay, what now? Uh, this artillery, you know what, actually go down to Santiago because I think that's more likely we'll get attacked here than otherwise. Um, anything else I need to worry about right now? We're good there. Hello, I see a diplomat over here. Hmm. We're about to finish up our some roads, which will be very important for us. I think we're in okay shape right now, shockingly enough. Yeah, being happy so I now actually have a reasonable amount of uh, science and stuff coming in again is big. Very, very big. All right, well, let's move on to the next turn and see what the damage was in the World Congress. Hopefully we get lucky. Uh, where's this guy going? Probably up to the Vatican again, which is a little concerning. Hmm, okay. Uh, Global War Games fails, and we got both. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So now we have 245 tourism. Much better, much, much better. Okay, City Connections for all of our Celtic territory. That makes a big difference in our happiness overall. Love to see that. What's this? Kaisel was impressed by my tourism. Well, you want to be friends? You want a land or sea trade route. I don't know how that's going to work, but okay. It'd be great if we could. Love to get some copper in my trade network. Uh, I have the lead with 10,000 culture. 26 turns until I can get influence with Monaco. Huh. Yeah, I don't see that happening anytime soon. Uh, Kaisel and Brazil no longer allies. Monaco and Brazil no longer allies. Vatican City. So, yeah, with that passing, uh, Brazil just lost a lot of friends, which is very good. Let's go ahead and, uh, found a new city down here. Doop. And we have Varna. 
Nestled in between the mountains, which should be relatively defensible. We'll set up this artillery, I think, and then go on alert. Um, you can just auto work from now on, I think. And let's land the troops before we can get caught out by any sort of naval force. Where'd my uh, ironclad go? There you are. Whoops. Nope, not you. Go up north. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Ugh. All right. So, yeah, now that we have that, sweet. We need to figure out, uh, first off, school board. That's more culture for me. I love that. To make a proposal. So we have 16 votes now, which is amazing. Um, I do not like the fact that the world ideology is autocracy. Because, let's see. Civilizations following the ideology get an extra delegate. So we could reduce the number of delegates that Brazil has by getting rid of this. Public opinion in favor of that ideology is increased for all civilizations. Which basically means that whenever I am... Um, in negative happiness, I'm pretty sure we get even more negative unhappiness because people will start looking at fascism and say, oh, that's so much better than we, what we have because we're miserable. Alternatively, though, what else? <laughs> this actually would have been useful for us, but no, we're not going to do that. International Games, Olympic Village. Ooh. Ooh, though. I'm going to go for the International Games. Well, I think I need to get rid of uh, I autocracy. I, I do. I do need to get rid of this. Boo! I would love the international games, but it's just gonna have to wait. Alright, Nikea. Uh, go ahead and get a... You know what? What do we want? More military units? Mm, I don't know, actually. Um, get some archaeologists. We do need more of those. In Varna, get some walls ASAP, because we need the defense. Uh, and what else? You're protecting Vatican City. Well, I might be able to actually get Vatican City. How quickly can I get up here? Pretty quick, it turns out. Next turn, I can try to take them as an ally. They're angry with me for some reason. Can't really imagine why you would be angry at me. That seems very rude and unhospitable. Look at all the units here. Gee whiz. America, I really hope you can crush these guys quickly, because I'm I'm going to commit a lot to this war. If we lose this war or you leave me high, to dr high and dry to die, bad things will happen. For all of us. Well, for me, anyway. You'll probably win the game. Which is exactly why you should do it, but I, I beg you not to. Alright, we'll defend in Santiago for now. And the time for the war has come. Oh boy, alright. Let's get it started! Ah, okay, really wonderful, he says. It's almost as if he didn't think I was actually going to do it. Would you look at that? Alright, my city-states have declared war. That's one, Cahokia. Well, I'm going to get Vatican City in on this before your diplomat can arrive. Hopefully. I don't know where you're going. Where are you going with that diplomat? I don't know, but I'm going to shoot it with my city, if I'm allowed to. Okay, Kiev and Brazil are now allies. Forest fire in Dublin. Lumber mills destroyed. That sucks. Oh my god, the numbers are flying. Okay, Varna does have a connection already. That was pretty quick. Okay, so America is actually taking the brunt of all the hits right now, which is great. So we'll try to do something to help out for a little bit. Um, you... You know what, you're close enough. Go ahead and set up and start hitting their infantry, I think. Let's try to destroy their riflemen in the Citadel if I can, and America hopefully can rush in there and take the rest. Let's conduct a mission here. I think we'll get Vatican City back. Did we? The camera keeps moving, so I can't tell. No, we didn't! Oh, because they were angry with me. Okay. Well, as long as his diplomat can't get up there, I think we'll be all right. Um, do I move the Rifleman forward now, is the new question. I'm going to have you heal, and I'm going to move you into the ocean. We're going to try to set up outside of Bratislava. This is going to be a little bit dangerous, I'm afraid. Oh, look, another diplomat. Let's try to kill that. Yeah, oh boy. Salamanca, can you hit it? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. So hopefully Brazil does not get either of their city-states back. What can you hit? Oh, hello. Hit the riflemen. Try to try to encourage them to get the heck away from me. Nikea, uh, I could use a land ship. I need a military academy. Dang it. Um, can we get a rifleman? No, I need a mi I need so many... Rah! I need the freaking military academies. Purchase a land ship here, please. And we will send this uh, to go and protect. Do we want flanking or cities? Flanking, I think. Wounded units, probably pretty good. So we'll go for that. You need to get down over to Varna, which amazingly, yes indeed, we do have a railroad system already connected thanks to the Celts. Thank you, Celts. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, our golden age is about to end, unfortunately, but not much I can do about that right now. Vatican City not being converted is really un disappointing, actually, not gonna lie. Uh, Constantinople, as soon as you're done with this, can you get me another diplomat? Or do I want more other things, like banks? Wire service. Faster production of diplomatic units. I mean, yeah. 15% of the production of the city is added to the current production total every time the city gains a citizen. Really? Fascinating. Hmm. Um, yeah, all right. Get the wire service as soon as that's done. We're about to get a train station, which will increase our production significantly in the city. Should go up by another 25%, so I'm hoping to see it go up by about 50, unless it's 25% of the base. Which is what? 128? Yeah. Okay, so it won't go quite that much. It'll go up by, like, 30. Which is still pretty good. Don't get me wrong. An extra 30 production? I'll take it. But yeah. Salamanca demands pearls. Okay. Hopefully we don't lose any units, but I have a lot of generals working over here, so, uh... You know, hopefully I can produce some uh, buffs to the Americans and so on. Where's our ironclad? Okay, sneak around to the north. We're gonna try to swing down and take this as soon as we're able to. But we need to clear out some units first. He is happy with my proposal. Good, that's more diplomatic stuff for us. They did kill the cannons. I'm taking a little damage, but not a lot. We're in a pretty good spot right now. Oh, never mind, they're moving. Okay. <laughs> little upsetting. Uh, hello, ironclad. Can I hurt you? Totally can. Do I care about you? I don't want America to lose an armored car, but... I care more about not losing my units, so we'll keep them in reserves. Um, can you please kill this so I don't have to lose any health as I land? Thank you. Can we please kill the stuff that's trying to flank me, like this? Uh, you hit that, and you hit... It's not quite enough to kill it, but... Maybe America can finish them off. Why don't you go here and kill it for me? Thank you! Okay. Hopefully this artillery will be alive. Let's go ahead and start getting some more artifacts. Uh, do we need to send more artillery over there? I'm just gonna hold off for the time being. You never know, might end up being useful. What's this? Kill the diplomats. There is no diplomatic treaty for you guys. And don't you dare get Monaco back. Uh, let's try hitting that. I just wanna discourage them from coming around the mountain range. Where's our um, land ship? How fast can you get here? Wow, they move fast on the railroads. I knew I liked those. So useful. All right, in Nikea. Zoos could be pretty good, but I think I need to get the military academy first because I can't purchase units there as a result. Uh, Adrianople's about to be done there. Would love to have Vatican City back. You want an archaeologist, huh? What are the odds I can get an archaeologist? I can't purchase them. That sucks. Hey, real quick, get an archaeologist for me. And we'll go up there, and we'll take advantage of the, uh... Oh, wait, maybe not. Well, I think America's actually attacking the city. Either that or the city-states are. Getting Vatican City would be good. I'm just saying. Am I willing to spend money to make sure that I get it faster? Actually, kinda, yeah. Alright, spend another thousand gold, get another diplomat. Forget the archaeologist for now, get the wire service. Yeah, um, the diplomat getting up here, if we can get Vatican City in on this war, he'll go fight Brazil here, and that'll pressure him in another direction, which will be great. Okay, we have used all of our stuff. Um, can you get over here, please? You can walk around in Bratislava? I didn't know you could go inside their city. That's convenient. I don't want to lose this artillery, but there's may it may not be an option. But we'll see. This ironclad, we'll see how fast you're able to move next time. Uh, okay. Okay, my workers are going around repairing and getting good networks, railroads, and so on. And we're not getting attacked over here right now. Next turn. You made a wise choice supporting our proposal. Once again, he likes me even more. We have a lot of positive modifiers with America right now, which is great. Hopefully it stays that way. I'd like to keep them as an ally as long as possible. Oh my god, they got nukes. Well, that's scary, America. Please be cautious how you use those. Oh my gosh, this artillery is still somehow barely holding on to life. America took Cahokia from me. You jerk. Whatever, I don't care. Um, alright, how fast can you move? You can get there in one turn, so stay there where it's relatively safe. Um, you move here and pillage to heal up. 
One, two. I need to get here. Okay. You need to back out. Oh, gosh. That's not quite where I wanted you to go, but all right. Can you please hit this? You move to here. You move to here. And then set up. Get a general in position. Zeppelin's okay. Go here and attack. Just trying to weaken them as much as we can. You just fortify. Go on alert. Um, and we will kill their diplomat. And then we will send our own diplomat up here to Vatican City. And with this land ship, what should we do? I could make this one good at killing cities. But instead I'm going to go for Shock Shock. And then, actually I want to send you to Nakia so you can get your altitude training. But we have railroads, so that should be relatively quick. There we go, but didn't even take all of his move. Nice. And then go back up. Event choice. More culture for me. Not a lot, but some. In Adrianople. What do you need? You're dangerous, you say. Well, there's nothing I can do to fix that right now. Military Academy for the XP or Hotel for the Tourism. Go for the Military XP for now in case I need to get more stuff. Varna can continue attacking things. Why don't you hit the Tercio? Kaisel is being attacked because America did manage to get them as an ally. That's excellent. Maybe we can get Monaco if we're lucky. If we're quick. We'd love to get them as an ally. But unfortunately, they are slightly angry at me. A little disappointing. Hmm... Hmm. All right. Well, Vatican City at least not being a threat is a huge deal. It means I don't have to worry as much about Barcelona or Madrid or Samarkand and so on getting just steamrolled. Uh, you're not defended right now. Why don't you um? Why don't you go here? Provide a little combat boost to this rifleman. I assume it's close enough. Okay. I want to start raining death on Bello. Uh, good. Why don't you just sit here in Varna? Give them some combat strength. Make them nice and secure. We should also get a lot of archaeologists if I'm able to, but I don't know. We'll see. Next turn. Why do we have a lot less... Why are we so unhappy all of a sudden? Poverty is even worse. How is poverty so darn bad? Like, for real. I don't know. I just lost my Zeppelin. Oh, no. Wait, no. Seriously, why is this going back down? Poverty is even worse. What is going on? I do not understand the poverty thing at all, apparently. Okay. Uh, you don't have range, do you? Hang on. Range. Did anyone, one of these guys had range, right? One of sister cities. Why don't you go here? Set up. Go here. You have nothing to attack, so move to here. Diplomat, get Vatican City on my side. And you will now have to fight Brazil. Which is good. Uh, you go to the tobacco and just smoke for a bit and heal up. It's fine. No problem. Go here. Oh boy, hello. Uh, can we please attack the Lancers and weaken them? You're already set up. Do I want to attack the city or do I want to hit the Riflemen? I'm going to hit the Riflemen so they're less likely to attack. And you... You know what? You're actually fine where you are. Just uh, provide a bonus to this artillery on the off chance that I need it. You heal. You go to sleep. Atlanta should already start bombarding some of these things. In Varna, the Empire State Building has not been constructed. Cool. Uh, why don't you get a Mandir and a Monastery. And also get a Castle. So we can get a little bit more defense here. Uh, oh, crap. So, Brazil did get Monaco back. That's unfortunate. Uh, they're sending infantry after me, but I have a land ship, so maybe we can defend ourselves, maybe not? We're going to send this land ship off this direction as well. I, don't, I wasn't planning on using them here, but we may end up needing it. Okay, we're about to get the civil service. We lost our strategic monopoly on iron. Why? I don't think my number of iron has really changed. I'm not really sure how that works. But okay. Any workers doing nothing in particular right now? What are you doing? Working on a railroad. Uh, you're trying to atta attach these things. This seems like a... It used to be that the AI was like, okay, the city is connected. We don't need to have more connections, but this one really wants as many railroad connections as possible. Why don't you come down here and try to get this iron back, because I want to have that. Okay, Adrianople demands copper. Aluminum discovered, or aluminium. Ooh, eight. Wow. An extra 5% HP when healing. Aluminum is good. Would love to have some of that. 
The st uh, strategic oil, um, oil monopoly would be really useful as well if these guys would just stop building railroads, but turns out railroads are important to them. Hello, Barcelona. Uh, maybe we should get this artillery up to the north. Yeah, if they have units over here. I mean, I think the Vatican City can probably handle them, but just get up there anyway. Just to be on the safer side. And I think that's good enough for this turn. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here, though. I'm not sure what's really hitting my happiness so hard. It feels like poverty and illiteracy and everything else is just kind of shifting up and down randomly. And I'm not too sure why it's bothering me, but we'll see. Thank you all for watching. Do hope you enjoyed. If so, then hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. And I, as always, will see you guys next time. Yeah.